Pretzel by Margaret Ray One morning in May, five little dachshunds were born. One of them was Pretzel. They grew up the way puppies do, and they all look exactly alike for the first few weeks. Look, there's Pretzel and Paul and Patricia and Priscilla and Percival. But after nine weeks, Pretzel suddenly started growing and growing and growing. He grew much longer than any of his brothers and sisters. And when he was fully grown, he had become the longest dachshund in the world. Pretzel was very pleased with himself, because it is very distinguished for a dachshund to be so long. When he was one year old, a dachshund is grown up at that age, he won the blue ribbon at the dog show, which means that everybody considered him the best-looking dog of all. All the dogs admired him, and all the people admired him. Only Greta didn't. Greta was a little dachshund from across the street. Pretzel was in love with her, and he wanted to marry her. But Greta just laughed at him. I don't care for long dogs, she said. But it is very distinguished for a dachshund to be so long. And I won the blue ribbon at the dog show, said Pretzel. I still don't care, said Greta. Pretzel was hurt, but he did not show it. Please marry me, he said and I will do anything for you. Prove it, said Greta, and went away. So Pretzel set out to prove it. First, he brought Greta a nice big bone. Thanks for the bone, said Greta, but I won't marry you for that. I don't care for long dogs. And she ate the bone and forgot about Pretzel. Pretzel had to try something else. He gave her the lovely green rubber ball he had been given for his birthday. Thank you, said Greta, but I still won't marry you because I don't care for long dogs. Besides, everybody can give presents. And she ran away with the ball. Look what I can do. Nobody except me can do that, said Pretzel when they met again. And this is what he did. Not bad, said Greta. Your name certainly fits you. But I like the pretzels at the baker's better, and I still don't care for long dogs. <sighs> Pretzel was very unhappy. Some weeks had passed, and Greta hadn't even spoken to Pretzel. One day, while she was playing with her green ball, it bounced away. Greta tried to catch it, and booms! They both landed in a hole. Greta tried to get out of the hole, but she couldn't. It was much too deep. She was terribly scared. If nobody came to save her, she might never, never... Just then, Pretzel's face appeared over the edge of the hole. I'll get you out of there, he shouted. He had watched Greta all the time and now had rushed to help her. How good that pretzel was so long! I believe you saved my life. You are wonderful, said Greta with a sigh. Will you marry me now? asked Pretzel. I will, said Greta, but not for your length. So they kissed each other. And one morning in May... Five little dachshunds were born. The end.